All right, I'm back. Your conversation made me laugh. I do want to get it done. Um, it's kind of a thing that as most or a lot of creatives have, I've struggled with in the past. And I think, or kind of proven to myself lately that I can do, that I can finish things and I should try and finish things. Um, and the best part about finishing things is that you can move on to something else and not have to worry about this stuff. Uh, that's a great feeling. Not always have it like haunt you in, the, in your unfinished projects pile of stuff, you know? By whom was she considered a danger? By whom? this far and not know their plan like what why do they not know what the villains are doing has, has this not come up yet really hmm hmm I disagree, Johnny. I disagree. There's not one inappropriate picture. Look at this. Sleeping cats everywhere. I did. I Google everything. My Google foo is quite strong. Anyway.
Google everything. All the Googles. So much Googling. <laughs> I, al <laughs> I always do the search first and then show it on stream. That's why I have two monitors. That's why a lot of things. Because I know, I know that that, that could happen. Um, and yeah, no inappropriate pictures for fluffy cat either. They are very fluffy cats. Like, look at this. It's a fluffy cat. Fluffy cat. Anyway, tangents, finish, finish tangents. Whatever, I just, I just click the image. I don't care. I should give that to Leisha as well. <laughs> yeah, no. <sighs> I don't like animals all that much. I'm kind of a computers and robots kind of guy. I want a Brendan Roma, robot emote. That's what I want. And I 
Really don't like this ending here. Cool. editing I think all 18 pages cool Green pens always suck. Anyway. Uh, move my girl about here. Okay. So I'm still gonna think about the changes I wanna make to that last scene. I'm gonna think about that. I don't think I'm gonna decide today. I don't think it's right to decide today. I don't think I'm gonna come up with an idea quick enough today anyway. So that's fine. Um, but that leaves me with about 30 minutes to for 30 to 45 minutes with uh, nothing to do. <laughs> Cause I thought this would take me a lot longer than it did. So what do you guys think? You want to do an exercise real quick? Uh, I was also considering working on the web uh, description for Fear the Siren uh, for my website. Um, yeah. I'm open to suggestions. Um, uh, Q and A period. I want to ask questions. Let me know. Let me know what you think. Make a straw pool. Oh, so lazy. Oh, actually, yeah, I could do that. I could research Greek goblins. That's something I could do. Something I could do for sure. Because they're European, and Greece is in Europe. root of a kobold. <laughs> it's a lot of steps, okay, Johnny? A lot of steps. Huh. Well, this is a whole different myth substructure. 
I mean, this isn't Greek mythology as we know, true, like classical Greek mythology. This is Greek folklore, which would be different. Uh, it has a lot more to do with Christianity. Um, Huh. Is a category for goblins? Interesting. Filipino folklore. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I shouldn't show that on. <laughs> That's hilarious. folklore So I'm not finding a ton of info on goblins and Greek myths. Other than this Christmas tree thing, which I don't like. But I mean, maybe something. Oh, I see what you're doing here. That's an interesting read either way, but not what I was looking for. I'm actually familiar with quite a few of these different types of goblins. Um, you'd be surprised. <laughs> well, a lot of that has to do with the fact that they're used in uh, a lot of role-playing games. <laughs> yeah. 
Interesting, though. The one thing I do uh, find interesting from this folklore tale is that their task of cutting down the world tree could be tied into uh, the demon, the idea of the demon being summoned. As well as as well as having uh, links to the underworld. Right? Uh, again, to make reference to our demon. So I'll consider that, um, and I will write that down. Cali Canceros. Okay. Okay. Nice. So, um, I'm just going to do some general uh, announcements, admin stuff now, and then call it a, a stream. Um, I'm pretty happy with my progress this episode. I'm glad that I got the editing stuff done. Uh, so yeah, big, big step. Uh, announcements bookkeeping, things to remember. Um, so I'm going to continue working on this story over the next uh, few weeks. I want to finish it by the end of August, get it done uh, out of the way. I'm hoping, yeah. Uh, I'm hoping that I will have some time off in September that I will use to do a new project, start a new project. Uh, so look forward to that. Um, if you've been paying attention to the website, I didn't have time this week to really update last week's episode. So I will be doing both of them uh, tomorrow, getting them done, ready and up, uh, finishing that things. And I should be releasing a update on the short story uh, within the next couple weeks as well. Uh, like its own page with its own documents and stuff like that. If you wanted to check out the text that I'm editing, uh, it is on the website. Uh, you'll see it on the URL down below. That way, that way, there we go. Pointing is hard. Pointing is hard when you're mirrored. Um, yeah. Uh, the text is there. Feel free to send me any uh, suggestions, edits, whatever. Uh, my contact information is all on there. Um, what else? Oh yeah, I'll also be adding the prototype interactive fiction stuff on there as well. Uh, so look forward to that. Um, anything else? Anything else? I don't think so. I think that's it. I feel like this is going to be my new stream time. I like it better. It interferes less with my day-to-day -day life. Um, means I can have dinner with my family, which is kind of cool. <laughs> and yeah. Uh, I think that's it. I think that's everything. Uh, so yeah, without further ado, uh, my name is Brendan. This has been Accidental Origin, your weekly writing web show. Uh, thanks all for coming out. You can check out uh, all VODs and all there. Follow me on Twitter. 
uh, let me know what you think. I'm always open to suggestions and conversations about writing, about streaming, about art um, in general. So, you know, keep in touch. Um, yeah, still working on my outro. So work in progress. We're getting there. It's getting closer. Um, yeah. Peace out. Keep doing awesome things. Um, don't be afraid to push yourself. That's it for me. <laughs> Thanks for coming, y'all. Uh, I will host somebody after the stream. So stay tuned. All right.